Hi, in this tutorial we're going to show you how to make a smoky toxic area which kills you uh, slowly over time um, and then we're going to show you how to pick up an item to disable that so you can walk through safely. First thing we're going to do is put down a numpad. Here we're going to add a VFX behavior and we're going to change the VFX to something that's suitable for what we need. Uh, we can do say area ground mist 30 meters, it's up to you what you want to do. If we click preview, you'll see we got some smoke and we can move that up so it's not in our uh, outside the doorway. Um, and we can go ahead and change the colors and settings for this. So if we go ahead and click edit logic, um, we got radius area, we can change and add color. So we'll go ahead and add color. First one is red, second one is green, third one is blue, and a fourth one is like opacity. So if we put these settings and click preview, we can see we've got a, like a green toxic smoke. Uh, and we wanna enable that at the start. And we can go and do control D to duplicate and we'll bring that up higher and click preview. So it looks like the whole room is smoky. Fantastic. Next, we're gonna add another, uh, we'll go ahead and first change these to no collisions and invisible. Next, we're gonna do the same for this numpad. And here we're gonna add a message broadcaster. This is what will be giving the avatar damage when they walk into the area. So the message to send will be damage 20. Damage double dot 20. Um, we wanna damage specific tags in range and that will be the avatar. Uh, the duration type will be forever and it will happen every second. Uh, we can change the radius to say like 15 so it's just entering the doorway and if we click tab and check out what we've done after it loads all right so you can see in the top left we've got 100 health and as soon as we walk in a toxic area we are dying by getting 20 damage every second awesome uh, next we want to add something like a helmet and this is like a hazmat suit that will protect us from the toxic when we walk in there. What we can do here is we can add a collectible and we can make it collision or interact. So interact will require the player to press E. Collision just means you can walk over it. We'll do interact in this case. Um, and the message we're going to send is um, helm on. So when we collect it, the message helm on gets sent and we can send it to all. We'll go to our message broadcaster that's doing the damage. We'll add a toggle behavior and we want to turn it off when we have the helm on. So let's do that test. We walk in the smoky area, you can see we're getting damage. We can go ahead and put our helmet on. I've added the visual effects that you can see from a previous tutorial. Um, and now when we walk in the smoky area, we're not taking any damage. So that's one way you can have a restricted area um, that's more uh, immersive and requires an item to pass through. I hope this tutorial has been useful. Have a great day.